all right now let's see how we can add new component using the angular cli so i will open my integrated terminal here and here let me first clear it so i can run ng generate and then maybe component component and then I need to pass the component name so in this case I will be using home now what I showed you in the last or first video we passed rider so we can first check what it will generate so you can see if we run this command it will generate uh, these four files home.component.html spec file for testing .ts file and scss file actually we don't want this like i only want to create home component.ts with inline styles and inline templates so what i can run is i will say first i will say i will pass dash dash flat all right so if i run it again you can see it won't create a home directory it will directly add files in the f folder but also we don't want these separate HTML file, spec file, and uh, SCSS. So for spec file, we can pass no spec and it won't create a spec file then. Then else what we can do, we can pass inline template and then we can pass inline style. All right. So if I run it, then it will create actually it is dry run so let's see what it will generate first so if i run it you can see it will create a home.component.ts file in the uh, app directory and then it will update app.module.ts here so let's run it without the dry run so that it will create the files for us all right so now if i go to my app directory you can see home.component.ts file here all right now to see it in the browser what we can do is we will go to our app.component.html then we can run app home then then this is because uh, we have defined uh, actually here selector here app hyphen home all right so if i save it and i go back to the browser you can see home works here all right i also want to add the routing now so what i can do is i want if i go to slash home of our website then we will open this home.component.ts file so i will go to my app.module actually we have already passed that routing module so we have this app routing module.ts so we will go here and here in the routes i can pass uh, actually let's see, path then for the home path we want to we don't have to pass like anything here that means we are saying for root we want to open maybe component the component will be home component make sure to import this so now if i go back and here you can okay you can see i am getting homeworks two times this is because we have already added it in the app.component.html so if i remove this and we have added router outlet here that is responsible for the routing so if, if i save it and go back here you can see homeworks here what else we can do is let's create another component so maybe uh, in this time we will create complete component just for demo i will say ng generate uh, let's maybe say about we don't need to generate maybe the whole files for this component i just want to show what other files it will generate so if i say ng generate about and press enter all right so we are getting an error so let's see all right actually we forgot to pass the component here so we will say ng generate component and then we will say about so now this will create 
this folder with all these files so now what we can do is we we can pass the routing for that about component to so what i want is i will pay, copy paste it so for the about route i want to open this about component and then i can save that so now if we go back to the browser for the root route we are saying seeing homeworks and then if i add about here then you can see about works actually we can add navigation there too so if i go to app dot component dot html here and here actually i'm using this bootstrap snippet bootstrap for snippets you can download it from vs code extensions so i will like just paste it actually i don't want this i want that uh, nav bar default maybe so one second nav bar default oh sorry and then we we can add it like maybe md then name for this maybe uh, users app and for root i won't pass any url so let's go further all right we have these two links actually what i can do is i will remove these here and then i will remove this one too and if i save it first let's see the output here all right so you can see the navigation here so actually uh, if i change it to bg dark that will be more clear oh actually maybe not uh, let's do bg primary so if i save it and then we can see the output here all right now this seems okay so let's go back here and change the maybe urls for maybe let's change it to okay home is okay then for the second link i will pass about and here for navigation we can use router link so you can pass for router link root for the home and actually we don't need this for now maybe we can similarly we don't need to pass array like we can use it like maybe all right this will also work so if i save it and now i go back to the browser so you can currently see this is about works and if i click on home you can see homeworks and similarly about works all right